That gave us a quick look on snake oil sitting on the water and how easily she handles at low speed. Are you looking for a great little sports fisher? Then come with me for a quick walk around tour on this 2015 Skipjack 26 foot fly bridge. She's a classic and this one's very well powered with a diesel engine, 300 horsepower, and she's got less than 125 hours on her. Fully equipped for fishing or just entertainment. Come with me. Here we are starting off at the port bow of this 26 Skipjack. She's a Southern California favorite, built locally here in Hesperia. Originally founded by Jack Cole in Costa Mesa. She's very well equipped for our Western waters. We've got a solid bow pulpit here, so you can fish here and notice we even have the tow rail right there. Snake oil has a windlass right there, non-skid decking, so she's safe to get around. We've got grab rails all the way around her and about an eight inch walkway. Here's a cockpit overview. Notice the in-deck gunnel storage for rod holders. And here at the extended swim platform, we can hook up a dinghy. One, by the way, is included. Let's go on board. We step on snake oil. And as you see, we have a nice ladder to get into the cockpit. This is designed without a door, so we can go further and stay in deeper water and fish comfortably. The cockpit can easily fish four guys. If you notice on this port side rail, we have a Honda 2.34 stroke outboard for the included dinghy. This cockpit also sets up nicely with a couple deck chairs. And notice we've got combing pads all the way around. So when the fish are fighting, we can lean into it. Your deck is nice and clean here. Off in the corner, we have a hot and cold shower and in-deck access right here. Access to the engine is nice and easy through this oversized hatch on gas struts. We have our Volvo Penta D6 300 engine right there. Everything is easily accessible. If you notice, there's room on both sides of the engine so you could work on it. Got dual batteries right there. Access to the bridge is nice and easy. Up the stairs, got inch grab rails all the way around, solid stainless steel tubing. Here at the helm, we have the individual bucket seat and then a side-by-side -side companion seat right there. Our view from the helm is great. We can see both sides and all around. This vessel has this Garmin unit right here radar gps fish finder we have an icom vhf radio our volvo penta engine management system electronic ignition three inch compass our ship's wheel and our flyby wire shift and throttle right there we also have our trim tab right here and if you look here these are lights to indicate their position this gives us a view of the cockpit right there and here's a great feature attached to the radar arch is a shade if you notice the cockpit is well protected and that easily slides forward so if you want to cast you can. From here, let's go inside.
We enter the cabin through this sliding door and down a few steps. Once inside to port, we see we have an oversized dinette with storage up underneath. This table also can be lowered for yet another sleeping area. Right up here, we have our 12 volt panel and our 110 panel along with our battery charger right there. Notice how open and airy it is. The side windows do open up for air and ventilation. The floor in this skipjack is aggressive non-skid decking. It's a fishing boat, so it's very important to be able to maintain neat and clean. If you notice, the ceiling is also gel coated, so it's, the whole boat is easy to care for, easy to maintain. As we move forward, Skipjack has made this nice and easy. These seats open up and cover the table. There's also lots of storage underneath. As we move forward, we see large berth. It's over eight feet long, four feet wide. Got lots of gunnel storage. We have an overhead hatch, anchor locker right there. And there's also more storage underneath. Right here, we've got places for storage and a bottle rack right there. Off to starboard, we've got a hanging locker with a great space here for a TV. Coming down along the side, we have the galley with a single burner butane stove, uses the one pound cans, stainless steel sink, drawer storage underneath, and our refrigerator right there. We've got a nice dish and cup rack along with a towel holder right there. As we move back, we have our head right here, fully lined, fiberglass, easy to care for, easy to clean. You've got the RV style shower, a nice stainless steel sink right there, vacuum flush head, and there's a drain in the floor so it's easy to shower and drain overboard. Nice wide steps in and out of the vessel, places to hold on to all the way around. The skipjacks were made to go far in our western waters. This is a classic example. Viewer today owner tomorrow at South Mountain Yachts.